So the cub enters the wolf's den. What do you want, cub? Have you now? Hmm, well, you're a bold one, I'll give you that. But why should I do this for you? Doesn't he? Caesar's representative tells a different tale. The glory of the great cons will be restored. And once the NCR is pushed back to California, all the land from here to the Colorado will be ours. I won't hear any more talk against Caesar or his alliance. The great cons will answer Caesar's call to war, and the NCR will pay for their crimes. Mr. Kaiser, I have been warned about you. You were perilously close to making an enemy of Caesar, and that is not wise. They're a tribe of fine warriors with many proud traditions and a glorious history. They will be worthy additions to the Legion. I heard you try to convince Papa Khan not to join with Caesar's Legion. I'd like to talk to you about that for a moment. You want to convince Papa not to ally with Caesar, right? Trust me, you'll get nowhere just talking to him about it. He's fixated on restoring the glory of the great Khans, and he sees Caesar as the path to that restoration. Papa can be a stubborn man, but he's not a tyrant. He listens to his tribe, and to four voices in particular, me, Jack, Diane, and Melissa. If you can convince all of us that allying with Caesar is a bad idea, you might be able to sway him. You'd have to talk to them, but those two have been thick as thieves since they were kids. Convince one, and the other will come around. I have my doubts about Caesar, yes, but I won't publicly go against Papa Khan based on nothing more than doubts. I've heard rumors that tribes who aligned with Caesar in the past were torn apart and reduced to slaves. Prove it, and I'll back you. Ah, Melissa. She's a bit of a dreamer. Last time she was in camp, Carl filled her head with stories of serving the Legion as a speculatore. Personally, I've never seen a woman in Legionnaire's armor, so I have my doubts. Good. Oh, one more thing. Caesar's representative, Carl, has become fast friends with Papa. Carl's the one who has him so fixated on this alliance. You'll probably have an easier time of things if you can find a way to get him out of the picture. Carl talks prettily about the honor and nobility of the great cons, but I suspect his actual opinion is less flattering. Maybe you could find something he wrote that expresses that opinion, or trick him into losing his cool in the longhouse right in front of Papa. I would too, if I were you. Greetings in the name of Kaiser. Join? Oh, no, I, I simply couldn't. That is, I'm not worthy of such an honor. Of course I am. That is to say, Caesar has many fine warriors, and I wouldn't wish to compare them to the great Khans. Enough! How dare you compare Caesar's finest to this tribe of savages? The mightiest great Khan is scarcely a match for a legion recruit. The burned man would leave their mightiest shitting themselves in terror. I would. That is... You motherless bastard. You'll pay for this. Great cons. Drive Caesar's dog out of our If he's too slow, he'll be Make it quick. I don't want to be seen with you. Hey, it's not like I'm super attached to working with Caesar or anything. But if he'll stop his patrols from harassing my runners, I'm all for it. I haven't heard anything like that. Do you have any proof? Okay. Come on back when you do. Whoa. New guy. Huh? Look, man, me and Diane, we don't dig on that politics stuff, savvy? We just make the product and make it get to a good home. Sure, Caesar's a drag, but as long as we've got each other, we don't care who the top dogs roll with. 
Dude, what a total haul. No way that's Copa Shishi. Yeah, okay. Me and Diane got your back. No sweat. Oh, it's cool, man. I got your back. What do you mean, helpful? My stuff already makes people feel grudelicious. Oh, you're right. I should start a side project making meds to keep my aura clean. Awe, true to Kaiser. If you're smart, you'll find somewhere else to be. Let me see. My god, this is even worse than I thought. Okay, you have my support. I'll tell Papa the Alliance is a bad idea. What do you want now? You can ask, but why would I do that? Carl told me all about the life in the Legion. He says I've got all the makings of a speculatory. What? No, he... What do you mean, aren't allowed to serve? Why would he lie about that? That lying little weasel. I almost fell for it, too. All right, you've got a deal. You can tell Papa I won't support an alliance. All four of my most trusted advisors have told me we should break our alliance. Maybe I should hear you out after all. Hmm. I've heard some things from my most trusted cons. It makes me wonder whether this alliance is a good idea after all. But I want to leave a legacy of greatness when I die. My tribe deserves better than this, cowering in a canyon and living on scraps. Tell me then, if I don't join with Caesar's Legion, where will I find my tribe's lost glory? The followers of the Apocalypse keep many records of the past. It's been a long time since we associated with them, but they might have something. Until you do find me something, though, know that I still plan to lead the Great Khans to fight for Caesar. Smoke rising from the east spells trouble. I hope the Legion isn't on the move. The Great Khans. Oh, you mean those raiders that used to clash with the Vegas tribes? Yes, some years back we taught them reading, writing, basic science. We hoped they would use it to make medical supplies, but they turned to drugs. I was never much involved in the cultural side of that project, but Ezekiel was. He's a member of the followers like myself, but his particular field is pre-war history and tribal culture. I do recall him being fascinated by the Khans. He kept going on about parallels to some ancient historical empire or another. He rarely stops in here these days. You do best to look for him out in the wastes east of New Vegas. He's always looking for new tribes to study. Oh, of course. I'm sorry, I do tend to get wrapped up in my own theories and forget that not everyone finds them as fascinating as I do. <laughs> here, I salvaged this book from an old library. It's a history of people called the Mongols. I think that's what the Khans built their culture on. You should read it, it's fascinating stuff. Ah, you're back. What else do you need? Hmm. This is exactly the kind of symbol the cons could unite behind. We'll begin readying the camp to move. As soon as Caesar makes his move, we'll depart. We will make ourselves strong again, and we shall conquer. You've helped me see Caesar for what he is, and I thank you for that. But if you suggest that again, I will have your head. If you should ever tire wandering alone, seek us out. 